Off the roads and inside, we are in the midst of a first alert weather day, and the wind this afternoon could really make things dicey. And Dan, this is going to last just, I mean, it's going to go on for hours here, right? Yeah, the wind will. I think the rain's going to settle down here in Nashville momentarily, but uh, just be careful out and about. We have the wind, the rain continuing for some of you for several hours to come, with the rain on the Cumberland Plateau probably through mid-afternoon. Tomorrow, the weather settles down. So today is a red first alert weather day. Tomorrow is a green not much going on type of day turning cooler. Then it turns frigid on Sunday, frigid with snow on Monday. Just got some new information in. One of the computer models finally finished coming in, so I'll talk about that in a minute. And even colder on Tuesday. I think Tuesday is the coldest afternoon. Wednesday morning should be the coldest with this first installment of Arctic air. And I say first installment because I see a second one as we close out next week. But in Mount Juliet, the rain continues. The difficult driving conditions continue as well. In downtown Nashville, it looks like it's trying to brighten there in the distance. Here's first alert live radar. And notice the back edge of rain is now in Davidson County. So we're right here in West Nashville. So if I walked outdoors now, I think I would see the rain done. John Toon Airport, the rain should be done based on the radar signature. And it continues to move along. Not to say we're not going to see additional showers. I think we will later on. But the steady heavy rain is winding down. Still until 245, we have the flood advisory for Southwest Kentucky. We're talking about Christian Todd, Logan counties. You're all in that. A trig earlier had one, but that's uh, not included anymore. But look at the downpours continuing for Cookville, Crossville, maybe some rumbles of thunder. I don't anticipate any severe weather in Middle Tennessee. That threat will be much farther south and the deep south. And then you can see down toward McMinnville, Manchester, Tullahoma. Again, that rain is continuing. Temperatures right now in the 40s where you're getting some sunshine. We have lower 50s. I think Nashville gets into this little clear slot. And so we'll even get some sun in Nashville. It is going to be temporary. And then a few more showers work on in probably around 3 o'clock this afternoon in Nashville. And then potentially some snow flurries as we get into tonight. A lot going on just today. But again, we've got a very busy forecast down the road as well. Here's 3 p.m. Mid upper 50s with broken clouds and a few more showers. Here's 7 o'clock tonight. A couple of flurries trying to develop more likely late tonight in south central Kentucky in the upper Cumberland Plateau just blowing around and that's it. 20s tomorrow morning in chilly lower 40s tomorrow afternoon and then turning chilly tomorrow night and in downright cold. Here comes the Arctic front by sunrise on Sunday. So if you're going out to brunch, you're going off to church, to temple, whatever you got going on Sunday morning, 14 for the air temperature in Murray and Hopkinsville, 19 in Nashville. This is the wind chill as the sun rises on Sunday. So Arctic air gets here Sunday tomorrow, not nearly as chilly. And then notice Sunday afternoon, the wind chill in the teens for most. Now we get into Sunday night late, some snow showers breaking out. I don't expect much in the way of accumulation at all by first thing Monday, maybe a dusting to an inch. I mean, that's I guess that's something there as we head through Monday. Based on what I'm seeing right now, I think the bulk of the snow event happens and it unfolds in through here. I do expect accumulating snow. Some of you getting a dusting to two inches. Some of you should get several inches of snow based on what we're seeing right now. A few days out now, it's just about two, three days out, especially I 40 points south and then snowing still Sunday or Monday night, I should say, and moving out first thing Tuesday morning. So there was concern. Will this continue into a big chunk of Tuesday right now? That does not look to be the case. It's really looking like a Monday event in southern and central parts of Middle Tennessee should get several inches of dry, fluffy snow from this as it moves on by. It's going to stack up very quickly. It's going to have a lot of air in it. It's going to be terrible for snowmen and terrible for snowballs. Just a heads up there. But the evening drive tonight, the road's really drying up nicely because of the wind. And then notice tomorrow we have sunshine as the clouds move away. A little breeze tomorrow, not too windy. And then notice we have the first alert weather day now for Sunday because of the Arctic cold. The bulk of the snow is Monday and Monday evening. If you have travel plans back into Nashville, for example, Monday night, that may be a really difficult uh, thing to do. And then uh, notice Tuesday, extremely cold. Wednesday as well. A little lull Thursday in the cold, 40 degrees. And then more Arctic air for Friday of next week into the following weekend. Two installments of Arctic air. All right, Dan, thank you. And we